Go on then, shoot. Go! Go! I knew I'd score. See if you can do it again. Okay. Ready, Jumpy? You won't get it past me this time. Oh, hang on. Wait a minute. Hi, Frankie. Hi, Alfie. What's the big deal? It's only Frankie. But you know how much I want to be a firefighter. <laughs> and you will be when you're older, Jumpy. I want to be one now. <laughs> Where are you going? To watch, of course. <sighs> Morning, Tina. Hi, Abby. What's up, Tina? Something the matter? Well, there is actually. I've lost Domino. Oh, no. She's my favourite kitten. What happened? She disappeared after her breakfast. And then I had to come to work, so I couldn't look for her. Let's go and look for her now. If there's an emergency, we can leave from your place. That's a great idea, Ted. Is there anyone inside, Max? No. They all ran out as soon as they discovered the fire. Oh, good. Wow. <laughs> They're coming back. <laughs> hey, Jumpy, it's your turning goal. I'm going to the fire station to talk to Frankie. See you later. <laughs> He's impossible. He's jumpy. I've looked everywhere. She's not indoors or in the garden. Maybe she's in someone else's garden. Let's knock on a few doors. Come on, Frankie, tell me. What makes a good firefighter? <laughs> well, a, a good firefighter has to be able to do all sorts of things. Like What? What? Like what? Like listening. Now, where was I? Oh, yes, well, for a start, you have to be able to aim a hosepipe accurately. Oh. oh, it's not so much fun without Jumpy. Oh, thanks. You know what I mean. Yeah, but it's hard to be cross with him. He's so mad on being a firefighter at the moment. Maybe it's just a phase. Oh, listen to you. You sound like Mum. Yeah, yeah. And you sound like Martin. <laughs> oh, look. Oh, hello, Kitty. Hello. Oh, <laughs> she's so friendly. Does it like football? <laughs> sort of. She's lovely. I wonder where she lives. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Tina. She's black and white, you say. Now then, I saw a black and white dog only a few minutes ago. But not a kitten. No. I saw a squirrel up a tree earlier. But not a kitten. No, I'm sorry. I don't think I've seen Domino, to be honest. But I'll keep my eyes open, I promise. Good luck. <sighs> now what? I think she's gone further away. Let's try the next street. <laughs> Oh, you have to stand still sometimes, Elfie. How else can I get you? <laughs> hey, oh. oh, thanks a lot, Jumpy. Oh, sorry, Tom. <laughs> Oi. Sorry, sorry. I should think so. Now I'll have to go and hang myself out to dry. Oh, maybe I should practice a different firefighter skill. It might be safer. <laughs> what on earth? <laughs> Frankie said... A firefighter has to be fit and strong. Oh. Right. Some way to go, then. <laughs> go on, Kitty. <laughs> wow, see her climb. It's gone a really long way up. Come on, Kitty. Come on down. I'm not going to find her. Don't give up yet. There's still a chance. Have you got any photos of her? Yes, I have, actually. You could make some posters and put them up. They may jog someone's memory. OK. Let's give it a go. <laughs> yes. I think 
think she's stuck. How can we help her? I don't know. Oh, there's Max. He might know. Max! Come on, Scoot. There's a kitten stuck up the tree, Max. Can you help her get down? Whoa! That's really high up. It's a job for Elfie, I'd say. Oh, yes. She could lift it off from her basket. Max to Barney. Barney here. I'm in the park, Barney. There's a kitten stuck in a tree very high. I reckon it's a job for Elfie. No problem, Max. She'll be with you shortly. Thanks, Barney. Elfie will be here in a moment. You. Don't worry, Kitty. We'll soon have you down. Ready, Elfie? Ready? Here we go, then. Oh, they've gone without me. Hey, Tom! Frankie, wait for me! Hooray! They're on their way. Oh, Jumpy will be so sorry to miss this. Maybe he's still following them. <laughs> Kitten's up there, Tom. No problem. We'll soon have it down. But where's Elfie? What? Elfie? Elfie! Hi, everyone. I'm the new Elfie. Jumpy! What on earth are you doing in there? And where's Elfie? I don't know. I was just looking round when suddenly Frankie drove off. Jumpy, you should never, ever get onto Frankie, let alone into Elfie's bucket, without permission. Do you understand? I'm sorry, Tom. But I checked Elfie was ready. Yeah. Uh, mm. Jumpy, you're the limit. Please let me rescue the kitten. I'm really good with animals. Look. Come on, little kitten. Jumpy's here. <laughs> oh. You went without me. Jumpy, what's going on? You're about to rescue a kitten, Elfie. Sorry about going without you. I'll explain later. Oh, you found her. Tina will be pleased. Tina? Why? Because that's her little domino, I reckon. She's been looking for her all day. Didn't you know? There. Hi, Max. No, are you sure? Oh, I do hope Kimmy's right. I'll come straight over. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Domino! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Elfie. And thanks, everyone, for helping to find her. <laughs> it was exciting, but I wasn't very good at rescuing Domino, was I? You hold on to your dream of being a firefighter, Jumpy. And in the meantime, play football and have fun, just like the other kids. <sighs> and you won't get into Elfie's basket again without permission, will you? What if we needed water and Elfie wasn't there to help? I know. I'm really sorry about that. Until I'm a grown-up, I'll stick with football. Because <laughs> I am the bestest footballer in the whole wide world. <laughs> Come on, let's play! <laughs> Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Tom! Tom! Oh. What are you doing? It's my day off, Jumpy. So I'm doing some painting. Oh, I didn't know you could paint. Well, I'm not too good at it, but I do enjoy it. Yes, that is the pond. Careful, Jumpy. Yes, that's the pond. And are those green blobs the trees? Yes. Over there in the fields, it looks like a big fire too. Tom, we've got an emergency. Tom's at Friends Park. It's his day off, remember? Well, he'll just have to take his day off some other time. We need him. Come on, you two. And those yellow bits? The daffodils. <laughs> oh, 
That sounds like Frankie. Oh, yes, it does. Perhaps there's a fire at the city hall. Oh, and everyone's trapped inside. And they're at the windows shouting, help, help. And the smoke is billowing around them. <coughs> help. And the flames lick higher. Come on, Tom. We've got a bit of a flap on. Hop in. Go, Frankie, go. Don't worry, whoever you are. Help is on the way. Friends Hospital. Barney here, Tina. We've got a big fire at Friends Farm. There may be casualties. We're on our way, Barney. Hello, sounds like an emergency. Oh! Well, would you look at that? Someone's been daubing paint on the city hall. To think we've got vandals in the city of Friends. Great red and blue splotches of paint. It's outrageous. Something must mm. be done. Well, we can't yes. have people walking through our town spraying no, paint well, on the walls. No. It's Did just not on, Bobby. Yeah. Graffiti in our no, town. It, it, so what are you going to do about it? Hmm? it yes, exactly. Uh, I'll get Max onto it right away. Max? Got a job for me, Bobby. Max, there's... Someone's been vandalising the city hall, spraying paint all over it. And I want... And something must be done about it. Yes, so, so I would... stand there, go and detect who it is. Uh, on my way. <laughs> That's it, Elfie. Tom, to your right. <laughs> so it wasn't quite as serious as Jumpy thought. If we'd had the fire he was talking about, we'd be here until next Tuesday week. <laughs> it does get a bit carried away sometimes, doesn't he? Sometimes. <laughs> and it was huge. Was it? There's never been a fire like it in the entire history of the City of Friends. The flames leapt a hundred metres into the air and the smoke was all black and sooty and... 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 What was on fire, Jumpy? Uh, it was an, um, a, a big sort of huge with fire and everything and... and... <laughs> Hi, Frankie. Did you put out the fire? We did that, Martin. Nothing to worry about, though. Just a haystack at Friends Farm. Uh, well, um, see ya! <laughs> mm. Mm. Still wet. Hi, Max! Sorry, Frankie. Can't stop to chat. I'm on an important investigation. Hmm. Struck again, right under my very nose. Huh. Come on, Scoot. He can't be too far away. <gasps> Jumpy, did you see the fire? Yes, it was. I mean, no. <gasps> huh? What? What is it? So it was you. You're the vandal who's been spraying the city hall with paint. Me? Paint? I... It wasn't me. Then how do you explain these specks of paint and those splodges? Uh, I can't. Hmm. Oh, yes. Yes, I can explain. Tom was painting in the park. I must have got some of his paint on me, but I didn't make that mess. A likely story. I've never seen Tom painting. It's true. He was. And his painting stuff should still be there. He left it when he went to put out the fire. Hmm. We'll see. But... But they were here. A picture and an easel and paints and stuff. I think you'd better come quietly, Jumpy. But... Whoop. What's that? Huh, you can't fool me with that old trick. <laughs> 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 
Max, what are you doing to my painting? I think he's trying to get it off. And where are my easel and paints? Looks like they're there, Tom. Well, Jumpy, it looks as if you were telling the truth. But it still doesn't solve the mystery of the Phantom Vandal. And I intend to get to the bottom of it. Um, I think this is yours, Tom. Oh, I'll just have to start again. Yes, I'll start again. Oh, I will track him down, or my name isn't Maximilian Tarquil de Montfort Spifford, the third. Huh? What on earth? Huh? Aha! So Tom's paints must have got spilled in the city square, and then people ran over them. So there was no vandal. No, just a series of unfortunate accidents. <laughs> well done, Max. You'll make a detective yet. <laughs> and now for your next job. I'm ready, Bobby. Get off to the city square and get that paint cleaned up. He... Uh, huh? Me? Why me? Tiffany's taken Timber for a walk and it's time for my lunch. So it's down to you. But... I... <laughs> oh... Hi, Max. Oh. What are you doing? Cleaning this paint off the walls. Oh, oh, can I help? Yes. Yes, of course you can. The more the merrier. Good, because I'm the best paint getter offerer of walls in the entire world. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Tom, what are you doing? I'm painting, Elfie. Creating. Hmm. And what's it supposed to be? It's the park, of course. Oh. Uh. Oh. Oh, it isn't. <laughs> oh, but it is. My first painting wasn't too good. But when I saw it after Max had smeared the paint all around, it looked sort of interesting. And I realised I should be painting what I feel rather than what I see. Oh. <laughs> well, at least you sound like a painter. Post. <laughs> Am I glad to see you're in? This thing's heavy, whatever it is. What is it? Oh, good. It's a replacement part for the coffee machine. Hmm. And what's that noise? Your bloke got himself a new sports car, has he? Sounds like a big one. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's borrowed Jim to dig up the backyard. We've decided to grow our own vegetables and herbs. Ripper idea! Yeah. Oh, I love fresh veg, well, especially he... broccoli. Oh, and spinach. Is he growing any spinach? Well, I... You know, when I was a little joey, I used to hate it. I but thought... nowadays, I just can't... Can Martin and Mia come out to play? I... Oh, what's that noise? I've got Jim out the backyard digging it up to grow vegetables. Jim? Brilliant! <laughs> oh, and cabbage. Oh, I love a nice... Oh. Wow, how great is that? Oh, hi, Jumpy. When I grow up, I'm going to be a digger driver, probably the best digger driver in the world. <laughs> <laughs> Can I have a go at driving Jim, please? Sorry, Jumpy, you need a driving license for that. Oh, yes. Yes, I've got a license. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm going to get a license when I'm older. <laughs> Ooh. Ow! Martin, get us some drinks, would you? This is thirsty work. Yes! Mum, can we have some. Oh. Oh. Mum? What's happened? <laughs> Dad! Dad! This 
thing fell off the table. Oh. Mum's hurt her foot. <laughs> Hello, Tina. Y yes, um, I've got a bit of an emergency. Oh, I'm all right. It's just a bit of a bruise. Ow! Oh. <laughs> Going to be just fine. See you later. Bye, Bye Ted. Ted. Bye, Bye, Mum. Bye. And don't worry, we'll look after the cafe. <gasps> Help! Quick! Jumpy, what's the matter? Where's your dad? He's gone to the hospital with Mum. Oh no! I started um, a gym, started up all on his own, and and he's gone. What? It's all right, Tiffany. Max has got it. <laughs> Still playing the police chief, is he? Yep. Every time Bobby leaves him in charge for half an hour. Oh, emergency! What is it, Max? I've just had Martin on the phone. Jim the Digger's running out of control. What? Where? Martin didn't know, but we'll have to find him. Come on, Scoot! <laughs> A runaway digger? Right, we're on the case. There may be casualties. Ted, we've got a call out. <gasps> These council meetings, eh, Barney? More trouble than they're worth. Hello? Sounds like Jim. Whoever's driving him isn't paying too much attention to what he's doing. Hang on. There isn't anyone in the driver's seat. What on <laughs> That oh. did just happen, didn't it? <laughs> We can't both be dreaming. B better get on to... Oh, oh, what a rogue digger to catch! Oh. Oh. Has the whole world gone crazy? <laughs> you missed a bit there. Oops, so I have. <laughs> What's that, Barney? <sighs> a what? <laughs> I thought you said runaway digger. Come again? Oh, sorry. The signal's Tom. really rubbish. Tom, I... there's Jim! And Just he... a minute, Elfie. I'm trying to speak to Barney. What was that again? No. Uh, say it again. Tom! It... There's... Slower. Tom, look! Look at what? Uh, he's gone. Who has? Jim, the digger. He was... He just... He didn't have a driver. <gasps> We'd better get after him. If someone's hit his overdrive button... Nope. No sign of him here, Scoot. Here to Max. Come in, please. Max here, Jeep. Receiving you. It's Jim. I've just spotted him. He's heading toward the harbour. But I'm at the harbour, G. I haven't seen anything. Hang on. That sounds like... Oh, no! Stop! Stop! Oh, I don't think he can. Someone must have hit his overdrive button. Oh! oh. oh. If he hits me, we'll fall! 
bouncing on time, Aru. That's what I'm trying to do. of Jim. I might be able to stop him. Okay, Frankie. <laughs> I can't hold him! Trying, Max. You're welcome, Bonnie. All in a day's work. Hang on. How Jim got to be trundling about on his own in the first place? What? Jumpy? What? Has this got anything to do with you, Jumpy? No. Well, well sort of. I was only playing. Oh, playing in the cab of a digger? That was a really, really, really silly thing to do. And you must have hit his overdrive button. Sorry. I'm really looking forward to planting our vegetables and watching them grow. Just as soon as Jumpy's finished digging over the ground. <gasps> oh, poor Jumpy. I think we better get him some lemonade. That looks like thirsty work. I'll never, ever go near a digger ever again. <gasps> ever. Careful, Martin. Oh, sorry, Stad. Have fun, all of you. We will. Bye. Bye, Mum. Bye, Bonnie. See you later. Spade? Yep. Crowbars, too? Yep. Yep. Oh. Sand bucket? Please play ball with me, Elfie. I can't, Jumpy. I'm helping Tom. Sand bucket? Sorry. Yep. Please. Oh, jumpy, Elfie's busy. Can't you play with your friends? <sighs> They're out on the sea sailing with their dad. Well, maybe Elfie can play later when she's off duty. But not now, OK? <sighs> OK. <sighs> what? I can't wait to get to Treasure Island. Is there really treasure there? Well, there's a picnic anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Mum. Oh, yes, fine. Really great, yes. See you later. Bye. See that inlet? We'll land there. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Whoa. I can't play for long, Jumpy. On duty soon. That's Whoa. all right. <laughs> <laughs> jump when I give the order. Aye, aye, sir. Ready? Jump. <laughs> Tie it up to that branch. Great. I'm good at knots. Seeing it, me arties. <laughs> <laughs> wow! X marks the spot. See over there. No, here be the spot. <laughs> we shall dig for treasure here. Martin, <gasps> Mia, quickly! What's happened? I thought you said you were good at knots. I'm sorry. I thought I was. It's not your fault, Martin. I should have checked it myself. 
Oh, well, thank goodness for mobile phone. Oh, no. Where is it? Uh, I'm sure it was in here. You gave it to me to talk to Mum, and I gave it back. Oh, must have fallen out. But it's, it's not here. And it's not in the water. Maybe you dropped it after we landed. Could be in the dinghy. So, no phone. Now what? <sighs> Sorry, Jumpy. I've got to get ready to go on duty now. OK, then. Thanks, Max. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Oh. Hey, G. Max, you got the wrong helmet. I know, I know. Jumpy's taken mine by mistake. Keep a lookout and tell me where he is, will you, so I can catch him up. I'll do my best. Raph. Receiving, G. Raph, I need your help. We're looking for Jumpy, but he's wearing Max's helmet. Oh, um, I can see Max over there. How do you know it's Max? I can tell by the helmet. It's Max's helmet. No, that's Jumpy. That's who we're looking for. Oh, good. Well, I found him then. So, where is he? He's, he's, uh, oh, he's gone. There. It's ready. Off you go. Hey! I can see right over to the beach and the city from here. Can you see G? Yes! Get waving, then. OK! <laughs> Max, we saw Jumpy just now near City Hall, but he's disappeared again. OK, I'll keep looking. Tell me if you see him again. Let's go, Scoot. <laughs> oh, that siren. Oh, why can't G see me? Maybe she's busy with an emergency. But we're an emergency. Oh, there he is. There's Jumpy. Do you mean you can see Jumpy or someone wearing Jumpy's helmet? Uh, I can see someone wearing Jumpy's helmet. So that's Max. Is it? Oh, I get it. Yes, that's Max. So that one must be Jumpy. Uh, Max, Jumpy's by the cafe now, on his way towards the river. Thanks, Ralph. Oh, I can see him too. He's crossing the bridge now. And he gets through two, three, four defenders, and he shoots! Whoops! Oh, Jumpy, you've got my helmet. I've lost my ball. Hmm. That's a job for Elfie. I'll call her up. As long as you give me back my helmet. Oh, sorry, Max. <laughs> Hooray! Max has got his helmet back. Well done, Raph. Thanks. Oh, gee, turn around, will you? Is that someone waving from the island? Um, yes. It looks like it. <gasps> Something's happening. It's Frankie, I think. Yes, he's going over the bridge. Hi, Frankie. Hi, Elfie. Here you go. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Tom, I think there's someone on the island waving a flag. Could they be in trouble? Hmm, still no answer. I do hope they're all right. Someone's waving from the island, Tiffany. It might be a distress signal. OK, we'll go and take a look. Meet me at the pier, Max. We're going to take a trip on Bonnie. Good luck. Take care. Tiffany, look! Oh, no! Someone's left a mobile in there. Martin and Mia were out with their dad. It must be his. But where are they all? I'm 
worried, Petey. His mobile's ringing, but he's not answering. I'm sure everything will be all right. Tiffany to Petey. We've got everyone, and they're all fine. Thanks, Tiffany. There you are. What did I say? Oh, thank goodness. Oh! <laughs> thank you all for coming to our rescue. And I promise I'll look after my phone better in the future. So it was you on the island? Yes. Did you see me waving? Yes, but Raph saw you first. Thanks anyway, Elfie. <gasps> oh, good, you're back. There's someone to play football with at last. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Step on it! It's not a race, Jumpy! <laughs> Who says? Hi, Kimmy! Kimmy! I've got the fastest wheels in the town, Kimmy! Watch me! Jumping Joeys! I'm going to need some help here! That's cool, Ted. Where did you get it? My old watch broke, so Dad gave me this new one. It's waterproof, too. Make sure you look after it. <laughs> I'm going to. Hi, Tina here. Oh, hey, Kimmy. Oh. What can I do for you? <laughs> oh, dear. How serious. OK, we're on our way. Ted? Kimmy, you there? <laughs> yeah, this is Ted. Where are you? OK, got that. And how about the injuries? Oh, right. Scratches and bruises. No problem. See you soon. Bye. Scratches and bruises? She made it sound like the crash of the century when she was talking to me. <laughs> That's our Kimmy. Ah, it's a cooked breakfast for me this morning, Timber. Oh, sorry. It's breakfast for one, I'm afraid. I won't be long. <coughs> so, just imagine when I saw this tangle of bikes and all the kiddies in a heap. Ooh, I thought to myself, I thought, I'm gonna need some help here. Ouch! So I got on the phone and... Here we are. Huh? You did really well, Kimmy. Thank you. We can manage now, can't we, Ted? Yep. Everything's under control. Well, if you're sure. Yes, you get on, Kimmy. And thanks again. Yes, thanks, Kimmy. Thanks. Bye. Bye, then. There. Oh, can I stand up now? <laughs> I hope so. <sighs> now, be careful, all of you, and look where you're going. We will. Especially Jumpy. Huh? <laughs> See you. Bye. 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 Oh? Hey, look. A watch. I think that's Ted's. He was wearing one like that. <gasps> we must give it back. Come on. OK. Which way did Abby go? Kimmy! Kimmy! Did you see which way Abby went? Uh, that's why. To the hospital, I think. OK. This way. See you later, Kimmy. Just be careful. I can't cope with any more dramas. <clears throat> there. All done. Hmm. Not a bad job. Oh! Oh! oh. Ouch! Oh. oh! No, stay put, Barney. Oh. I'll call Tina. Oh. <gasps> no! What's happened? My watch. It's gone. Maybe it's on the floor. Uh, not on my side. <gasps> Tina here. Tom, hi. OK, just keep him still. We'll be right over. What happened? Barney's hurt. Oh, no! <coughs> when did you last have the watch? Uh, right. I was wearing it when I was helping Nira Martin. It's probably still there. Try Max. He'll get it for you. Good plan. OK, Ted. No problem. I'll go straight there. Can't stop to chat. I have to find Ted's watch for him. Tiffany here. 
I've got a job for you. OK, Tiffany, we're leaving now. Don't worry, Barney. Tina's on her way. Oh, she's here already. Ted's not here. Nobody's here. They must have been called away again. Let's try the police station. Why should we go there? Because that's where you should take lost property, isn't it? Good thinking, Jumpy. Let's go. Let's try to liven things up a bit, shall we, Scoot? <laughs> OK. Maybe not. Have you seen Ted? He's at the fire station! <sighs> hmm. No sign of a watch. Hey, Kimmy! Hello there, Max. What's up? I'm looking for Ted's watch. He thinks he lost it here. Have you seen it? Uh, no, sorry, I haven't. But Martin and Mia might have. Ted was looking after them, you see. My, was that some pile-up? When I saw it, I said to myself, I said, Kimmy, I uh, said... The thing is, Kimmy, I have to find them fast. Do you know where they went? Well, funny thing is, they were looking for Ted too. They went to the hospital. Great. Thanks, Kimmy. See you. You're welcome. I... You're lucky it's only a sprain. I know. Thanks. I'll be more careful next time. Now, I wonder how things are going at Max's. We'll give you a lift over there if you like. Ted! Ted! There's no one here either. Where is everyone? <coughs> It's a long story, but Ted and Tina are over at Max's. There's a fire there, and they've taken Barney with them. Oh! Thanks, Ruff! Ted! Ted! Oh, this seems to be the case of the disappearing medic. Oh. Ted! Hi, it's Max. Where are you? Uh Outside your house. Why? What are you doing there? It's on fire! What? <laughs> Only joking. It was on fire, but it isn't anymore. Tom and Elfie have put it out. That isn't funny, Ted. What happened? Looks like you left a flame burning. Were you cooking this morning? Oh, yes, I was. Oh, stay there. I'm coming over. Did you find my watch? Max? Martin, that's brilliant, but I don't want Dad to know I lost it. Ah! Ah! Oh, no! It's all fine, Max. No damage. Just a pan on fire. There. Oh, it's out. Phew! Hey, thanks, Elfie. Oh, oh you found it. Shh! He doesn't want Bobby to know he lost it. Huh. Hey, I, I've just realised. Today, just in this one day, the medical crew have helped out at the fire station. That's right. The fire crew have helped out here at the police station, and the police, well, you, Max, anyway, have helped out the medical team. Which just goes to show how all of us in City of Friends help out everyone else. <laughs> That's true, because we found Ted's watch. Shh! Shh! So, three cheers for everyone. Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Ha 
Happy birthday, Frankie. <gasps> Hope you have a great day. With not too many emergency call-outs, eh? Hey, Frankie, how are you going to celebrate your birthday? Oh, <laughs> the less fuss, the better, Raph. You deserve lots of fuss, Frankie. You're the best fire engine in the city of friends. <laughs> what would make me really happy is to see all my friends today. <laughs> That's more than enough for me. Sit, Timber, sit. <laughs> Oh, well done, Timber. Good boy. Stop, everybody. Listen to me. Hi, Jumpy. Hi, Jumpy. Guess what? It's Frankie's birthday. We know, Jumpy. We're just about to go to the fire station to see him. I'm going to give my friend Frankie the bestest, biggest surprise in the whole wide world. Frankie's not one for a lot of fuss, Jumpy. He might get embarrassed by something too big. The fire crew have already bought him a new bucket for his birthday. Ha! I'm not thinking of silly buckets. I'm thinking of something... something... humongously brilliant. Hey, Jumpy, want an apple? No, thanks. Banana? Nope, I'm too excited to eat. I want to get Frankie the bestest present in the world. I just can't think of anything. How about a football? Nope, Frankie doesn't play football. Um, he might like a new fire bucket. Got one. You could get a big balloon with a picture of Frankie on it. Martin, that's the brilliantest, bestest, fabbest idea ever. <laughs> Happy birthday, Frankie. Oh, thanks, Abby. Everybody's being very kind to me. You deserve it, Frankie. <sighs> Where's Ted? He's gone wood chopping in Friends Forest. He said he'd drop by later. <sighs> Just wait till Frankie sees this. The hugest, bestest balloon in the whole wide world. Oh! My beautiful balloon. It's gone. Oh. What's the matter, Timber? Jumpy, I'm so sorry. You know what, Jumpy? What? If anybody can find a flyaway balloon, it's Haley the helicopter. Max, you're my bestest, bestest friend in the world. Oh, and Haley, Haley's my bestest, bestest friend too. <laughs> hey, let's hope Max can find Haley's helicopter key. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Oh, looks like somebody's lost their balloon. <laughs> a smiley-faced fire engine. It'll make a lovely birthday present for Frankie. Any sign of a bright red balloon, Haley? No luck so far, Max. Oh, please, please keep on looking, Haley. I promise I'll do my best, Jumpy. Always have a bandage handy. Hmm. Ah, oh, oh, oh. Ah, hi, hi, Tina. It's Ted. Are, are you receiving me? I'm so deep in the forest I can't get a signal. How am I going to get home if I can't walk? Better not tell Frankie that Max and Haley are out searching for his birthday present. Not a word, Bobby. <laughs> Happy <laughs> birthday, Frankie! <laughs> Timber hopes you're having a lovely birthday, Frankie. <laughs> I certainly am. Um, didn't Max come with you? Uh, no, he's busy right now. He said he'd drop by later. Oh. Down 
down here! Help! Oh, how can I make Haley see me? The balloon! If I attach something of mine to it, they'll know it's from me. Oh, I only hope it works. It's no good, Max. I can't see a balloon anywhere. Okay, Haley. Thanks for trying. Sorry, Jumpy. We've got to head for home. Haley! Stop! It's my balloon! My beautiful red balloon! I'll fly as close as possible to the balloon. Grab it if you can, Max. Okay. Oh, oh, there you go, Jumpy. Oh, Max, you're the bravest balloon catcher in the whole wide world. And it... Oh, who put a bandage on my balloon? Oh, it's a hospital bandage. Come in, Abby. Hi, Max. Where are the ambulance crew? Tina's working in the hospital and Ted's in Friends Forest. Friends Forest? Meet me there as soon as you can. I think Ted might have had an accident. <gasps> Hayley, we need to search Friends Forest. Hold on tight. Martin and Mia should be here soon, Frankie. They said they'd pop in on their way home from school. <laughs> I haven't seen Max, Ted and Jumpy all day. Do you think they've forgotten it's my birthday, Elfie? Of course not, Frankie. They'll turn up any minute now. Promise. Hmm. Help! Down here! I can see Ted. Hold on tight. I'm going to land. It's no good, Max. I can't get close enough. We can't leave Ted down there all alone. We've got to do something, Max. Don't worry, Jumpy. Abby's on her way. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad to see you, Abby. Oh, what happened to your knee? I accidentally hit it with the axe handle. Oh. Lean on me, Ted. Uh, Let's get you into the ambulance. Oh. Frankie, did you get any big surprises? I got a new bucket off the fire crew, and all my friends had been to see me. Except for Jumpy, Ted and Max. I, I think they've forgotten it's my birthday. Oh, what's going on? Where's Jumpy? <laughs> Surprise! Happy birthday, Frankie. Oh, oh, thank you, Jumpy. Sorry I'm late, Frankie. I had an important pickup job to do with Jumpy. <laughs> Happy birthday, Frankie. Oh, what happened to you, Ted? I uh, had a little accident in Friends Forest. I don't know what I'd have done without your birthday balloon, Frankie. And I certainly wouldn't be here without the help of Haley, Max and Jumpy. <laughs> That's all right, Ted. We're all the bestest, bestest friends in the city of Friends. Happy birthday, Frankie! <laughs> 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 <laughs>